Here's the solution to this, the deductible trap. Very innovative company came along and the industry wasn't thinking about it and hates it, hated it. The industry representative told me not long ago, golly, I did not think about that idea. Really smart idea. What it is, it's a company that says financing, they looked at the bill and said payment over time. It's not a loan. You don't have to charge the, you don't have to charge the customer interest. It's a subscription-based thing. You join for a year. There's a booth here. Highly recommend you go talk to them. They'll show you how to do it. You just sign up, and they just check to make sure your customer's payments are, are being done. That's it. Gets around the law. Well, the industry lawyer freaked out, sent a letter to, to, to them, and said, I'm going to tell all my customers. What did he say? Not that you're going to jail the rest of it. I'm going to tell all my customers not to pay your RCV because that was the plan in the beginning. So what do we do? We go to the Texas legislature and explain to the Texas legislatures, act, the legislators actually what the deal is. This is what they might be doing. They might have not told you what the truth was about what they were doing here. Now maybe I'm being cynical. Okay, maybe they just really wanted deductibles paid and they weren't trying to just trap but we went to legislators and they said, well, my goodness, I mean, if they call us and they say that this FMD doesn't work, then we'll know, we'll know that it was a Trojan horse. So I went back to the industry. We talked to the owners to say, you know, this works. And they've agreed. So this is a solution to that issue.